Welcome to the advice show media of the common sense approach. So as most of you would know, last week Prince died and I was very shocked to hear Prince passed away. I mean, Prince uh, was just 57 years old. Uh, Prince was left a legacy of music. He still have uh, what they say, possibly a thousand songs locked up in the vault that he have not even released yet. Now Prince was a person that took care of himself. Um, he never heard Prince really into anything that's, that's wrong or messed up. Uh, Prince also got all his music from Warner Brothers, which is something that's unheard of. He beat them at their own game, just like Michael Jackson beat um, Sony at their own game. And it's quite strange, and a lot of people have been saying this, that when they get their music back, all of a sudden Michael Jackson's dead. Prince get all his music back. Prince is dead call it conspiracy theory, but I'm looking at it like it's too much of a coincidence that every time you beat the system, you you, uh, popping up with strange things happening to you and you're dying. But you have to understand the country that we live in. So it doesn't surprise me, but continuing, there's a lot of videos been popping up of Prince. And there's a video that popped up with Prince that invited Kim Kardashian on the stage to dance. Well, most people who actually know about Kim, she has the personality of a boy and you will see what Prince do to her for not participating. Let's go roll the clip. For me, that was funny. He said, get off the stage. Because you're not doing that. You're standing there. The man don't want you to stand there looking. He say, dance. Do something. You know, I mean, if you want to stand there and look at the man, she should stay in the crowd. But that's but that's her. I mean, she don't really do anything. Like I said, I don't see how somebody would be with the girl personally. Because like I said, her personality is extremely boring from what I see. Um, you know, you, I like people like to have fun. Like to, you know, enjoy themselves. Not all that stuff you saw with that girl on that stage. But, you know, unfortunately, there's a lot of silly men that, you know, even one of them for sure, Kanye, wiped the chick up and had two kids with her and everything. But you know how some of these men are today. They don't have any backbone, aren't alpha males, you know, weak minded, beautiful woman that a bunch of men then ran through. So, but that's a totally different situation to even get into. But Prince was definitely known as the king of shade he would look at people funny he would say things and it's things we're going to miss about prince prince was a one of a kind it'll never be another prince at all um you know this man is extremely talented i remember shoot when i was a kid um i wanted to play guitar because of prince and you know i think i took maybe like two guitar lessons at the time and i couldn't continue it because you know the money aspect at the time growing up but, you know, I really wanted to do that as a child. Uh, but Prince was just definitely um, someone that we all grew up with, at least in my age group. And it's crazy that Vanity died like in February and then now Prince died. I mean, this is crazy. A lot of people died last week. You had China passed away from WWE. Yeah, Doris Roberts passed away uh, from Everybody Loves Raymond. I mean, those who watch that show. I mean, a lot of people are passing away. It, it, and it's just like, wow, it's just like a week for everybody just be passing away or something. But, you know, we should live our life to the fullest, take care of ourselves. Um, you know, like I say earlier, that music industry, a lot of people say it's the devil. And, you know, if you see what really go on in a lot of it, and people that's been involved with it, they'll tell you that. It is the devil, literally. Uh, because you have the wrong people controlling your music. Uh, that's why I tell people you can get the money, control your own music, and these people won't have you in their clutches. Make sure you check out the studio we're building. as one campaign in the description box. We're building a TV Red studio, but we need your help. If you'd like to do it privately, you can do it at advisorshow.com. Hit me up in the comments, future commentaries. Subscribe.